Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If this even makes it to my channel, but I'm going to basically be trying castor oil to induce my labor. Some people are against it, but my doctor said that babies are gonna poop in you regardless if you're close to your due date or if you go over your due date. Like, it is a possibility that the baby can poop in you. And that's like one of the main concerns that people have when trying to take castor oil. But y'all, look at his belly. I am so over being pregnant, bro. I'm over it, and I'm just ready to meet my little baby. So, I'm gonna try it again. I tried it before, but like, I, like I couldn't even keep it in my mouth. Like, I threw it up trying to swallow it. So, it didn't work, and I'm trying a different type of castor oil, like a different brand of castor oil. So, I got some lemonade. And I got some Kool-Aid, and I heard that you you should do make to make the castor oil actually work. Let's say eat a full course meal. So I've been craving seafood all day, so I got me some seafood. And I'm gonna watch TV, but I'm gonna try the castor oil. They say take two tablespoons. So that's what I'm gonna do, cause y'all, if y'all hear that rambling noise, it's my dog playing with his bone, but. I am, I'm ready, I'm ready to meet my baby, and I'm ready to, you know, not be pregnant, I'm ready to get my body back, you know what I'm saying, I, it's been a nice road, but it's time, like, y'all, she's so, she's massive, dude, like, I just, I don't know, of course I'm kind of scared, because what if it do work, like, what if it actually works, but, we're gonna try it, and I'm gonna do it on camera, if I end up throwing up, I'm going to, like, take it off. Because, yeah, I just took some nausea medicine, so maybe that'll help. So, yeah, we're going to try this. Okay, y'all, so I'm about to take the first tablespoon. Ugh. I'm real scared. Because last time I threw it up. I'm going to try to pinch my nose. Oh, Okay. Don't be scared. Okay, y'all. I do it over a sink just because I threw up. Okay. Okay, let's see if it stays down. I just want to be sure before I walk away because I really don't want to throw up in my food. Last time, I had just ordered Papa John's and I took the castor oil and I threw up all over my freshly made hot food. Yeah, but Paul John's was real nice, you know, that day. They really sent it out. We're in VP for that. Okay, y'all, so I ate a little bit more. So, I'm about to take my second and final tablespoon. Wish me luck. I'm about to do it. swallowed it. I have never been able to swallow it, but I did it. I just had to work myself up to it. My lips real moisturized now, too. Okay, I'm gonna stay over here for like three more seconds. Just make sure I don't throw it up. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then I'm gonna bounce on my yoga ball for about 30 minutes, 45 minutes. And I'm gonna just keep myself active and I'm gonna get some rest after, but I'm gonna finish eating. And we're gonna see if it works. Oh my God, I'm gonna be scared if it do because I'm gonna feel all the pain. But I'll be back 
if it decides to work it is currently it is currently 10 10 at night it's it's night time so i'll be back for an update wish me luck god be with me if this is happening please let this be a safe and healthy de delivery vaginally what, whatever is in your plan god please I'm just on over it, like, we're gonna see. If this is my last time being pregnant, get a good look. I'm gonna miss my little belly. I will say that, like, if this is real, but I'll be back if it works. Y'all, I'm recording this just in case it really is the real thing. Hold on, I'm about to like put it somewhere. But this is my stomach right now. Oh, it's um, going on six o'clock in the morning. I know last time I like recorded, it was like 10 at night. But I've been in and out of the bathroom since like three o'clock for one, for two. I was just on the toilet and I was trying to poop because I feel like I had to poop. And I heard a little plop. So I look in the toilet and it's like red stuff in there, which I'm guessing that's blood. So, and I've been having really bad cramping. I, I don't know if these are Braxton Hicks or if they're the real thing, but they've been hurting. They always say you don't actually know when you're in labor, like you know when there's real contractions. So they could be fake. It could be like the false contractions. I'm cold because I keep my I keep my house on 66, and you know I'm usually in the bed at this time. But I've been in and out of the bathroom. I'm using a heating pad. My lower back is hurting. I honestly don't know if that was my water or not. Like a little bit of my water mixed in with other stuff because oh my god, it was like. And then when I wiped, it was like pinkish red. Uh -oh. Um, yeah, I don't know. Um, I felt something else coming out. I don't know if that's my water coming out slowly, but I'll keep y'all updated. Like I said, it's, hold on. Okay, it's 6.01, and this is your girl. Mm, mm -mm. I ain't gonna lie, I'm, it's starting to hurt. And it kind of makes it worse laying down. I'm so bad if my phone's shaking. I'm sorry if my phone's shaking, but it's like cold. But I'm sorry. I mean, what am I sorry for? I mean, like, it hurts when I lay down. So I might, like, just walk around or something. I don't know. I might, like, be on my labor ball. My, not labor ball, but my um, yoga ball for a little bit. And I'll be back. So last time I told y'all, it was 6. Oh, one now is 6.22 and I wiped again and it's like dark red stuff coming out not dark red but like it's it's red like it's not like a light pink anymore so I think this girl might be really coming like we about to see what it do and I keep like I'm in pain but I'm in I'm in bearable pain right now like it's not it's not too much. It's never too much. Like, I'm never too ill to say, no. Um, yeah, it's pain, but, like, I take pain really well, so. I ain't, you, know, you probably ain't gonna see me cry. Cause I, this is gonna be my labor and delivery vlog, too. Like, if I really am in labor. I mean, you might see me, like, stress out a little bit. But I'm a G. You know what I'm saying? I think I'll be okay. But I'm really up, like, wide awake at 6 in the morning. Almost 7.30. But I'm glad that I set up her little swing thing. I'm going to show y'all. This is her little swing thingy. I'm going to show y'all how it works. And it's Bluetooth so I can connect my own music to it. But I just think it's like so cute. Bluetooth. Look at that. That's her little net. Oh my god, I got to pee, y'all. At least I think I got to pee. But, um, see? Oh my god. My little baby. But, um... Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna keep you updated. Okay, it's kind of hurting a little bit right now, but um, I'm gonna keep y'all updated. Um, I'll come out within like the next 30 minutes or so, or 
whenever there's something else major that might happen. So I'll let y'all know. Oh, my water is just breaking. Oh my God, it's just coming out, yo. I don't know if this is allowed, but yeah. Oh my God, all that shit just. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my God, it's still going. Okay, yeah. Y'all, it worked this time. Oh my God, it's still. What the fuck? Yo. Oh my God, yo, it's still going. Yeah, y'all, it worked this time. My, it just, it splattered everywhere. Y'all, okay. I have to sit in one spot. Let me time my contractions. I'll be back. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna time the next one because I think I waited too late. But I'm about to get all my stuff ready while my baby dad and my grandma's on the way. I'm gonna try, but I really have to stay in one spot because it just keeps coming out and I got carpet. I'm not trying to get stuff on my carpet. Sorry, y'all, I'm not gonna call me. I'm gonna call you right. I mean, I'm not gonna call me. I'll be paying hey, y'all. So, get my bonnet. I'm putting all my other extra stuff that I didn't already pack in my hospital bag out. Some lotion, my body, my body gel. And I wanna have the edges done. I wanna have my edges done. So I'm gonna bring my oh my god my edge control and my little edge brush and I think I'm gonna bring my grease and stuff because I'm gonna be in there for like two days you know I still want to take care of myself so that's all I think for like oh no I already got a toothbrush and stuff packed so no toothbrush um I need to get stuff for my face I'm just gonna take what I got. I'm gonna get ready when my baby dad and my grandma get here because I don't know. I'm I'm just in pain right now, but I'm gonna keep y'all updated. It's going on Okay. It's 7:36 right now. And I, I wanna give y'all timestamps on everything. But um yeah, this this hurts. This it does hurt. It hurt, but it's it's bearable right now. It's bearable. It's it's bearable. So I'm gonna keep y'all updated. I might like come back when I'm going to the hospital or when I get to the hospital so I'll let y'all know so y'all um I had to come to the hospital first but I'm three centimeters dilated and I got me some food because I know they're about to starve me to death but I'm three centimeters dilated so I gotta go check in the hospital so I'll keep y'all updated the hospital is literally up the street from my doctor's office so yeah so guys I forgot to update y'all but I'm at the hospital there's the monitor or whatever Y'all can't see it, but like there's stuff strapped strapped to my belly, and I've been having contractions, and they do not feel great. So I'm gonna try to record as much as I can. They're not gonna let me record her coming out, but I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to anyway. So we gonna see. <sighs> I'm on the ball right now. So um, yeah. Ooh. Hey guys. So oh, it's currently what time? It is um, 2.07. Okay, it's 207 <laughs> and they gave me some Pitocin, so um, my contractions are like more consistent and more painful now, and I'm back on my ball. And they put something up my vagina in oh. my uterus, and it's not comfortable at all. But this is my life right now. I'm just waiting for this little girl to get here. This is so painful. Little girl, if you see this when you get older, know your mama went through a lot. Oh, you're having one. We're ready, girl. Yeah, I'm ready. about to have one. Oh, you got it, baby. Is gone. Hold on. Yeah, it's fluctuating. Okay. Oh, my God, y'all. What a freak. Fudge knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I ain't think it was going to be like this. You know I what I'm saying? Know. I thought it was going to be a walk in the park. You know what I'm saying? And I'm really trying not to get the epidural. Like, I'm really pushing through. I'm going to try my hardest. I'm going to try my freaking hardest. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. I want to try. Yeah. Don't look at it. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you see this girl when you older, I came a ways down for you. Here. Um, like this. <laughs> right. Everyone, she is having a contraction. And this right here is how you can tell that number. Where's my finger? Oh, right there. The number is going up. So she's having a contraction. Oh, 
Yes, it's coming down. Ow. So her contractions are coming down. As you can see, the little number is coming down. Danny, look at what your mom is going through right now. Oh. <laughs> okay, guys. She's six centimeters. Anything you want to say to the family? You guys out right now. Okay. <laughs> Well, I'll be back. Well, y'all, I'm like really loopy, but look behind you. Look over here. Getting ready. Oh, yeah. We're getting ready. I'm six centimeters. Oh, oh my God. This stuff is painful. This is the funnest How do y'all have multiple kids? I told you earlier, you forget this. Oh, <laughs> Way. Just a little fan. Ooh, okay. Guys, if you want, put that through the bottom part. Yeah. See, oh maybe she's it like that. I got me. Okay. Anything you want to say? No. <laughs> she's gonna look at this and be like, bro. <laughs> well, she's six centimeters and she's obviously ducked up on pain meds. <laughs> Mm. Don't mind the lashes. Yeah. <laughs> That's supposed to get. It's okay. Well, she'll be here soon. So, I'll keep you guys updated. Say bye. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Bye, guys. The fan still not working. I mean, not, not, not charging. It's charging. Yeah, it's charging. I don't right think now. it's ready, though. Oh, I don't actually have thought about that before I came here. Mm, guess what you would not like right now? Uh, My lips is chapped. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, my ears are fuzzy. <laughs> oh, this stuff is like... Man, I cannot wait till you see this when you sober. <laughs> she was like, bro, you could have greased your lips up. Well, guys, she's in a lot of pain. Daddy's here. Grandma's here. Take it off? No, keep it on. You cold? You cold? No. She's kind of loopy right now. Let's see if I can get a better view of her. She's coming in Yeah, don't pull that when it hurts. Okay. <laughs> you want cranberry juice or water? Yeah. Oh, there you go. Want some more? Uh -oh. Tyra, say hi. <laughs> She's doped up on payments. But I have a contraction now. You got this boot. Say hi. hi. She's been getting through some contractions. She's kind of tired and doped up. 
chocolate. She's like, get it, girl. Oh, don't fall. But yeah. Yeah, pretty girl, baby. Alright. See you later. You okay? You okay, girl? Seven centimeters, guys. Got it. Oh my baby. goodness! Look at her! Congratulations! I know. Congratulations! Oh my goodness! Look at her crying. Here we go. We just got to yeah. roll up a little bit. I got a video. Look at her crying. Nah. You can always crop it out. Right? Yeah. <laughs> you have that hat? I can suction if you want to grab her hat. Oh, there we go. You got some fluid in your nose. Listen, she's still attached. Okay, so try, just don't pull her up too far. I still got her attached to you. Okay. Do you have your camera? I'll take a picture of her face right here. Look how that sweet girl. Look at that little boy. I know that's easy for me to say. <laughs> You're doing so good. I can't believe it. Hey guys, so I just had my baby. I'm still a little high still from the meds. But this is my little baby. Oh, oh. Okay, you can stop. I already kind of closed out this video, but I forgot to add in there. I did get like a little tear, but it wasn't bad enough to get stitches. So that was good. But I'll give y'all like a full, like I said, I'll give y'all a full birth video, um, like in a story time. So, yeah, I know y'all can tell it on in my, ooh, bless you. I know y'all can tell it in my face that I'm really tired. So, bye. Hi guys, so it's currently 3 a.m. the next day. My baby was born 9 9 2022 so she was born technically yesterday she's doing good this is her say hey her name's danny savora and i only push for like 20 minutes oh i only push for like 20 minutes but i'm gonna close out this vlog and i'm gonna do like a like a birth story time video in a separate thing but i'm supposed to be going home and i go home on sunday so is that basically say i'm going home in two days or one day okay so i'm going home in two days this is my postpartum belly it looks like i'm like four four months five months but i know it's gonna go down but i've just been trying to get a little bit of sleep in because I really haven't, wow, I haven't really slept like that in 24 hours. Dang, I've been up since 3 o'clock yesterday. <laughs> oh, I'm sleep deprived. I'm, I'm going to try to get some sleep. But I appreciate whoever watched my video. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.